All right, guys, so today we're going to be going over on how to use the LED SLT light table when you're affixing films for use with our TriSync system. Equipment that you'll need is the light table itself with the pin bar attached, obviously your film, your carrier sheets, some tape, and a loop. So the first step, what we're going to do is place our first carrier sheet down, making sure that you just uh, gently slide the carrier sheet onto the pins. We don't want to damage the holes that it goes in. Uh, it will mess with your alignment later. So what we're going to do is we're going to find your film or your image with the longest printed area and use that to line up with. We're going to line up the top of that film to our image top line printed already on our LED board. We're going to line up the registration marks so everything's perfectly straight, perfectly centered. Tape, tape the film down to the carrier sheet. And since I'm gonna line all my other film up to this specific uh, film, I'm also gonna flatten it out and tape the bottom of it too so it doesn't move. My next step is I'm gonna grab another carrier sheet. Again, gently place, place it on the pins. and line up the next film with the one that we have taped down already. So once you line up your registration marks with it, you can use your loop to double check on how close you really are. A lot of the high detail stuff, you, you might not be able to actually see the registration problems with just your registration marks alone. Sometimes you actually need to look at the image and see how that lines up. So we'll tape this down, and I'm actually going to, when I take my film off, I'm going to flip it over, tape the back side of the, tape the back side of it too, and that just helps with the film really not moving anywhere. Repeat that for the rest of your films until you're done. All right, so last and final step, remembering to remove our original film we were lining up to and taping the back of it, we can now realign all of our films back on these pins to make sure that we didn't miss anything major, that there was no user error on us setting these films up. Thanks for joining us today, guys. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that like button and join us next time for the exposure process.